I know you have your own reason or you're just simply curious on how to remove the CMOS battery in your PC. CMOS battery locations are different depending on what motherboard you have, but this is most likely located near your GPU slot or what we call the PCIe slot. For ATX motherboard and MATX motherboard, the CMOS battery has a battery slot like this. For mini ITX motherboard, it is located near the PCIe as well but it looks different. The battery is covered in black plastic and it has a little uh, plug that connects to the motherboard. To remove the CMOS battery on ATX and MATX motherboard, just simply push this lock and the CMOS battery will pop out. To place it back, just simply push the battery inward until it is locked in place. To remove the CMOS battery on mini ITX motherboard, just simply detach the small plug from the motherboard. To place it back, simply plug it the same way. There are a lot of reasons that's why some of us need to remove the CMOS battery. For example, if you have lose your monitor signal or at times when you overclock your build and all of a sudden your PC stops working, or you see the reboot and select proper boot drive on your display. Removing the CMOS battery for 5 minutes will give you a hard reset on your motherboard BIOS and this will set everything to default. By doing so, your PC may start working again. This video is made for those who are doing basic troubleshooting in their PC. If you got any more questions, just write them down in the comment section below. I'll try my best to answer them all. So that's it guys, this is Mac and I hope you found this video interesting and helpful. If it does, make sure you give it a thumbs up and share it. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.